Hello everybody, it is your friendly neighborhood Axwober along here with The Shookster. Shut up. And that yeah. No, I can't get it actually, dude. <laughs> yeah, so um this is an MW two um live game of Nostalgia. Team Death nostalgia, some more nostalgia. Nostalgia. The game hasn't even started yet, but um so it's some live and what we're going to be talking to you guys about, we're gonna even try to oh, man. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna try to play a live game of MW3 while playing the game and talking about a strongly opinioned topic, kind of like a rant. And that topic is chicks. You said MW3. As I said that. MW2. Oops. As I shouted that. You did. I did. That's what you said. Yeah, I said one. <laughs> so yeah, okay. our topic about women is um. So you guys, we'll go around and each describe our own dream girl. Uh, who wants to start? I don't think that's a good way to start. I, I think it's a good way to start. We, we should we talk can... about pros and cons. Pros and cons of relationships? Yeah. Like, just girls in general, because the hot ones are never the nice ones. That's definitely true. All right, we'll start with that. Like, that's sort of... That, that's not always true in that case, because... I yeah. have never met a girl that doesn't follow that. Where? Well, there's a... Th y y we're not going to mention names, but you know which one I'm talking about. Your girlfriend? Or what? your ex? No. Um, you know, the one in my... The, the one who has a nice whore? ass and talks about it with me. Yeah, the whore. The ho yeah, whore. Yeah, yeah the whore. Right, the whore. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that one. I think I'll use an RPD. It's it's um the one the one that I was thinking about. You know who? It's the whore. The whore. Josh calls her the whore. I call her the whore. Uh, uh, I think I should read. No, just go on. Yeah. Yeah, just go on. Right. I don't give a fuck. So who um is. that like she she's really nice and she she's also like one of the pretty popular chicks. She's a whore. She is kind of a whore. It's awesome though. But uh shit, there's a guy. Yep. Um so that's the case. I don't always think like that's definitely true cuz the girls who are like um hot usually are pretty stuck up and kind of annoying. That's why like I have hot chick friends. It's just I don't know. They're just more stuck up in general, I guess. Yeah. So what do you guys I kind of do want to describe each of our like individual dream girls. Do you guys want to start? I don't really have one. Really? Just describe. Really? Just describe everything you like about a girl, like each each physical feature. Brunette, nice, smart. That's what I want. Ja Jake, you. Um, like, like how like all the girls like, are go like going blonde, and how I don't even like blondes. Mm -hmm. So just anything I like. Yeah, just your yeah. your dream. Uh, anything but a redhead. Hang on, anything uh, at all, Jake. No, he said anything but a redhead. Uh, well, redheads aren't bad. Well, some of them can be crazy. I don't know. A lot of guys don't like redheads. Like I like redheads. Red it's just I don't no, know. So any any redheads out there? Like just all the redhead girls are nice. Think. I can, the, all the redhead girls are, like easy to talk to. Yeah, there's a different tone like of redhead girls. Like ginger redheads, never. No, no. Oh great, fucking painkiller, gay. Um, ginger Go for redheads, the head. huh? Go for the head with painkillers. Yeah, I tried, but I was head glitching a bit. All right, continue. All right. So, um, redheads, there's, like, gingers. Oh, God, no. And there's, Soulless. like, there's kind of, like, the darker-haired redheads, which are, which can be hot, depending on, like, the face, like, uh, other than, like, the hair, the yeah. tone of their hair. It's all basically a... a Dang, if that was a quick scope, if that was a hard scope, I want to see what kind of scope this was. This. Yeah, I saw that happen. All right, so, um, so, Jake, yeah. yours is anything but, like, a redhead? And, uh, fun to interact with. Definitely. And enjoys some of the same stuff I do. Yeah. Because that's kind of one of the keys into finding a good relationship. Finding someone that is either your equal or complete opposite. Prop your opposite because if you can find some other interests, you okay. like you can discover new things you guys like with opposite each other. Attract. Yeah. That's what they say. Yeah. But I don't think it's true. So pretty much someone that can create excitement for you. Mm -hmm. That's definitely true. Um. But, so I'll start off my way of saying this with, uh, so last year pretty much all health class. Do you remember how me and Ralph would always go back and forth saying how, like, like, and this is out loud, how, yeah, personality. Um, Ralph would always say, personality is all that matters. A girl could be butt ugly and I would still date her as long as she was nice. And I was like, Ralph, that's bullshit. A girl could be, like, bitch and I'd date her because she's hot. Um, but, uh, that's mostly just me being me in our class. I don't really feel that way. It was just for the sh uh, shits and giggles during that class. And for, because a certain friend would 
think otherwise. Yeah, and who knows? It's really fun to have separate opinions, like, with your friends. So, but, like, I will always say that, um, girls, like, oh, crap, sniper, hang on. All right, got him. Um, I would say that girls' personalities don't matter, but in fact, they really do. Like, the perfect girl for me... Uh, just so you know, the game's almost over. Uh, so yeah. I, w I would like to start this out. We got some time. Maybe a minute or two. We oh. could we could yeah. have multiple sessions. True. I'm willing this to go for a two for right now because this is a really fast match. Yeah. All right. So um, my dream girl um, I like her brunette. Yeah, brunette. Everyone's just a brunette. Yeah, but everyone's I, blonde. I like brunettes. Like if I was blonde, maybe blonde, but I don't know. I just I like brunettes. Fuck. Yeah. I'm not on a nice little streak. I was so on nine. Brunette, and I would like her to be like perfectly curvy. I cut like. Not huge tits. I think perfect C cups are nice. Uh, I'm more of an ass man, so yeah, nice butt. Um, also, she, it's like, not a weird person. Like I like someone who like likes to start the conversations, gets them going and stuff. But I, I'm really like talkative and stuff once I get into it. I want a girl that yeah, I can ask anything is. about, and then she won't be offended. Yeah, I know. That's that's what like, that like how I asked Hannah what it was like to queef, and she was like, "Don't ever talk to me again, God." Yeah, I know. She's ah, uh, God. Hi. Two oh, guys shit. hacked in this lobby. No, they got they. That probably means they got hacked. Eleventh prestige means you probably just got hacked. All right, so Jake, continue. Your your dream girl. Uh. Where did you finish? No. Uh. Not really done. Pretty much what Axe Looper said, but I like uh. The upper deck better than the lower, just because there's so much better to look at. Mm -hmm. Although there's more that, risks of being caught staring. Oh yeah, but they're just fun. I think girls always know when you're staring. They probably do. That's why I try not to. But sometimes you can't help it. You gotta do what. You gotta stay true to your manly nature. Yeah. I think when all of them gets back, we should like talk about how to approach people, like girls, the hot ones. Yeah, because the ugly ones are like easy to talk to, chill. Actually, any girls, just easy to talk to. All you do is start with "Hi, how are you," and that can just be the whole conversation. Next time, you can think of other stuff, to talk about, and mm -hmm. and when you guys start talking and. Uh, to connecting more, you will start a more better relationship and have a better conversation. Yeah, but that's the problem with me. I can't get the conversation started. I'm too afraid to. You know, like, well, I'm not just going to go up to some hog girl and be like, hey, what's going on? Okay. What the fuck? <laughs> or, or that. I don't think girls like that. I don't either, but I still would start a conversation like that. No, you but that's nice the problem with me. It's like approaching. Right. Talking yeah, I, know well, then I can name three girls you and go that well two you wouldn't go up to and say that i don't know if you should name them i will not name them but i know two you wouldn't do that too right, name them later to me i will because um, i kind of would like to hear anyways me and josh were talking about how to approach a girl yes yeah and i thought that was crucial i think the most important thing to do is never second guess or think yourself yeah that's the thing because i'm a huge overthinker i never I have am. a problem i am extremely fluid with words I'm not kidding. Uh -oh. I know the perfect comeback for every situation. Well, yeah, I know you do, but yeah. Hey, you're stupid. No, I'm not. I have great grades. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Like B pluses <laughs> and A pluses for every class except one, where I have like a D. Ah, <laughs> you suck. It's no, English. That, that was not I can't do English. It's okay. I had a D plus. I have a 90 in, in class. Social in studies. Light. You're stupid. All right, okay. Guys. So, talking about approaching a girl. Yeah. That's definitely probably the hardest way. Like, once you get that step out of the way, then it gets easier. But, like... All you have to do is make... Yeah, but it's different for you guys. And small talk will create... Will combust into... Yeah. It's and different just, for you all, because you're, like, that popular guy who's always got, like, friends around and is willing to do just everything. And I'm that nerd. No, there's, like... It's two different perspectives. I don't know. And there's this guy in the middle. Me. I'm part yeah. nerd. Part... Jake. Okay. Yeah. Well, but there's nothing really that I can do to like not be a nerd. I'm always gonna be one. I've always been one. It's what I do, and I'm I good you at. Said, like, you were like really popular in grammar school. Uh, no. I thought you did. Never said that. Oh, well, the thing no, about like approaching a girl is like 
it's it's just it's hard to right, find the right situation too. It's not like they're um, God or anything. They're just a person. But yeah, it's it's all the pressure. It's kind of like it's just the way we look at it today in our society. Yeah, and the hardest part about like talking to a girl is the, the situation in which you are going to talk to her because it's almost impossible like to start up a conversation if you have nothing to talk about and you're just gonna go up and like sup. I, I, in IPS, I sat next to a really pretty girl. Well, yeah, it's and all, all I did was made small talk, and now I tell her I love her and she loves me, and it's not real. <laughs> we just joke about it. Yeah. And we exchange evil looks back and forth. I also think that the hardest part about get, talking to a girl is getting them alone where they're not surrounded by their friends. That's especially if you're going to, like, ax them out. I? I yeah. What I, I do there. is... That's horrible. Try, <laughs> I think what the best thing to do is try to talk to them while they're with their friends. Because... So you get, like, used to their friends. Yeah. If the friends their, will be like, friend, if their doing friends doing are over. used to you... Um, then that person you want to interact with might get more comfortable with you and talk to you more. Yeah, like, it's, like yeah, but the thing is, they're like always surrounded by a mob of people. Like especially not the always. Not always. Not always. So that's why. Just like opinion, the super super hot ones. I'd rather have like a super hot. Girl. That's why you try to get classes with the girl. Not yes. mean stock. Exactly. Because that's weird. I'm not gonna like go out of my way to try and get a girlfriend. I'm not going to do that. I'm not willing to. <laughs> but that's pretty much the much. way society works. It's like. There are girls with absolutely shit personalities, except they have all the friends in the world, just because they're hot. Yeah, that's the way it is today. And like the nerds are always the like the ner peop They're nerds. They're not popular, and we're gonna make millions right off of college. <laughs> While the popular kids that look great are gonna be probably the McDonald's. hobos you see in McDonald's. the street. <laughs> or McDonald's. McDonald's. That's, that's probably worse than being a hobo. Mm. Burn on McDonald's, people, Jake. <laughs> Well, well like, pretty much if you work at... No, uh, I was not going to say anything. Right. Do it. So <laughs> I don't, I don't want to offend any religion or anybody that works at McDonald's. I want to be alive. I want to be alive. Well, um, what I was also saying is, like, I also think about a perfect girl. It'd be if she was hot. Like, all those categor like all those things I described earlier. Yet also, she, uh, like... Was a nice person. Was chill. She was chill, but wasn't crazily popular. Because it's almost impossible, like, to talk to someone if they have so many like friends. Like someone that is well known everybody. and a lot of people like to talk to her, but yeah, she's not like always spends every minute. That's not that's you can't talk to someone like that. Commando, by the way. Also, the thing is, like, all the this girls are dating seniors. Too, buddy. On, Josh? Oh, hey. All the girls are dating seniors. I know. That's what I hate about high school. Cause all the, like, all the hot freshmen are dating the upperclassmen. So us freshmen, like, it doesn't go the other way. Freshman. Yeah, we got no chance whatsoever. Yes, yeah, so all the like you don't want to date like. Pretty much, if you're doing freshman year in Maine, you're pretty much screwed with. Well, yeah, the only girls guys. that the freshman boys get are the fugly ones. Yeah, and who do we get next year? Like when they come up, because where we live, we really don't have that great. Um, like we uh, get soft girl is like yeah, one twenty people. Yeah, we don't we don't have a great in in baseball terms. We don't have a great farm system. I don't know what that means. Farm systems like your minor leagues, like players that come. I up don't. Later I don't know that either. And I played b baseball for a while. So you mean you this guys don't have like a great variety, like no, hot well, girls? This is, and this is a major. This is like it's a, like a box of chocolates. On system thing. No, no, what you get, but. Well, what I'm saying. Our box of chocolates they are mostly terrible. It's but like a yeah, that that exactly one, right. You can only judge by what they look like. You can't tell what's inside. Yeah. Well, our farm system. Basically, what I'm trying to say is what's coming up later isn't great. Like our farm system. Oh, I just got a through the smoke final kill. Well, what I'm oh. trying to say is what's coming up later is not great for us. Oh, we also, great for Eddie. you know how you have those hot, well, not hot girl friends, just those average looking girl friends, yeah. but once they bloom into magnificent beasts. That's the problem. Like, there was this girl at her school. There was this girl at her school. She was like, she was like ugly and she had, she was like a little bit overweight. And then this year. Like, over the summer, she lost all the weight. She's got great curves. She's got yep. a great body. She's super nice. And I see her as that fat girl. I know. That's the weirdest thing. And the problem is that she talks to me, and I can talk to her easily. But you wouldn't want to do anything because she's no. not a fat girl? Yeah, that's the way I still think of her. Let's make it a three for her. Yep, okay. I'm good for that. All right, so continue. If we have to, a fourth her. A fourth her, yep. We'll just get this point across. Yeah. But yeah, girls, there's such a... It's such a hard top. It's such a hard thing to go about over. Because you really can't topic. understand them. Sometimes. It's like a maze where you can't see it. And I legit think that girls are the craziest thing, especially like uh, clingy girls are the worst. Yeah. 
I don't think like, they're the worst. Huh? They should. They can't. They're not like the worst. They're not, especially when you don't like them that way. Cause I just went to a. Uh, like, the uh, girls that are the worst are the ones that like cheat on you and lie to you and all that stuff. Ah, so uh. Oh yeah, the, those kind of girls. The the yeah, last one for me. The flirts. Oh God, you're just describing. You know who? Oh, I, I know, know who. who. Yep. <laughs> oh, just so you know, I kind of annoyed her by saying H repeatedly, and she was like, stop! I was like, no. I've high five. She was like, you. really? Period. And I was like, fine, if it really bothers you that much. <laughs> She's so, oh, God. It just pissed me off. I, 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 honestly, I did not care. kind of felt happy about it. I will, I totally respect you for that, Jake, just so you know. I just stopped caring about being nice now. Been nice for too long. I don't know, like, I think... I, I mean, what are the real benefits of being nice? All you do is having people walk all over you. No one really respects you. You are describing me. Well, it, it depends. Shut on up! What, describing depends. me. This is my time. <laughs> it depends okay. on what kind of nice you're being. If you're being like just the kind of nice that um. Like so respond. nice that you would give some random guy fifty dollars for nothing. I am not that nice. I, I would not exactly give call money. that nice though. I'd call that like stupid. No, not not even stupid. Like I'd call it stupid. It's nice, but it's like over generous, I guess. Gener generous. That's like perfect. Kinda. Like it's like two. You're that nice guy that anyone, someone can say anything to you, and you just be happy. That's the kind of guy you do, really don't want to be. Mm. I'm the nice kind of guy that would let you cheat on my test, even if we, even if the teacher's staring right at me. I am too. But. I kind of stay away from those people that would, that aren't as well educated as I am for that situation. Dumbasses? Pretty much. Oh, yeah. Dumbasses, yeah. Well, if you say dumbasses, you're kind of offending a lot of people in Maine. And uh, but, if you say Maine, you're also offending a lot of people in Maine. It's just the drugs. People seem to do drugs. I can't, people can't stay out of drugs. Like, there was this nice girl at our school. She's, like, been really super cool about everything. She's nice to everyone. She's the hog girl that talks to everyone, even the nerds. She's not superficial or anything. And she's talking about doing pop. Oh. And I'm like, this sucks. Yeah. yeah. I don't see why people think doing drugs and drinking at uh, underage is cool. It's not cool. Yeah. It's just that everyone All it does is mess up your life. Like People's it really like, was. I don't, like I don't you know, have you seen that story about the guy with the radio voice who was a hobo? Yes. Oh, yes. He, he his life was messed up because of alcohol and drugs. Yeah, yeah. I bet he was one of those kids that did that back in the day. Probably. It's not that people think it's cool. It's just that their friends do it, and they want. <laughs> well, to their friends must think it's cool. I it's just that, uh, you know, uh, that kid that we talk about that's a total douche that, that we yeah. hate. You know, him? they did spot. His sister did it. His dad did it. His well, mom did it. Yeah. Did, did it or does it? His sister did. does it. Oh. His dad did it. Yeah. That's that's not good. That's um, the thing. And people say understand. that. And people that say marijuana is not addictive, you're that's already yourself. addicted. Yeah, exactly. That's how you know when you're. Addicted. If you don't, if you say you're not addicted, you're addicted. Yeah, that's how you know. Yeah. But I just don't understand how the stereotype that pot is cool. Like, I, I don't it's really not. know. That's, that's not a stereotype. I don't understand how that like came to be. I was talking to my friend. He's a total stoner pothead. He's not gonna have a future. We were like, <laughs> um, "Shut up, guys! It's not serious." It's we were talking about it. We were like talking about drugs and stuff because I don't know a lot about it. So I learned that it was thirty bucks for one joint. That's that's so expensive. I know thirty bucks one. I, d well, I it's like even, thirty bucks an eighth, but that's, that, that's like one blunt. Can I add something about it? It's not really yes. about drugs. It's about cigarettes. People that smoke. They probably spend a lot more money than people do on dr drugs because cigarettes are a lot cheaper and more convenient Accessible, to find. Yeah. Dude, one cigarette is seven minutes off your life. Really? I know. Yeah. I've never smoked a cigarette. I'm not going to either. Yeah. My dad used to smoke, but now he's using them to get yeah. off. My dad used to smoke too, but he just stopped. Same, both my parents. Really? Your mom did? Mm hmm she doesn't seem like that kind of a person. She was uh, that. She was in, in that group in uh, high school. Oh. So she was in Joey's group. She, no, she wasn't. She wasn't that group. She was like a a partier. Oh, so she was part of Cool Kids. I don't know. <laughs> so it seems like that's always the way it is. Cool Kids party. Nerds don't. It's true. 
Do you guys think you're gonna party? Hell no. I party uh, hardy. I don't wanna get roofied. I don't think it goes that way. Usually guys roofie chicks. Yeah. Well, you don't know what. I heard a story. Never hear stories of people, of dudes getting roofied. I, I heard a story of when guys just put roofies in just one whole big keg or thing of alcohol and everybody was drinking it. That's retarded. That is really stupid. You can go to jail for roofing. Yeah. Like, even have association with it. It's like. I, I, I could have had a montage moment just saying. Really? What happened? It's like. I was using my FAMAS. I don't care what people say. It's good. It's badass. As it's the type 95 in this game. Like, I was killing one person, then another one would pop up. It was all like in a line. Oh, like, Dump nose. Alden Jake, I just saved you. Thanks, bro. There was a guy coming up behind you, and I just saved you. I was like, you ain't sneaking up front. You right, can't kill my friends because you, you suck. Oh, okay, guys, I got. Another topic for another commentary, but I'm not gonna share with you guys because spoilers are stupid. You gotta just give right. a little preview, just say like the first like syllable. No. Are you kidding me? All this <laughs> they have to wander, just like you guys have to. All right, all right so match is almost over. Match we got like 20 more kills. That's it. 10. Let's just. And you guys got. Let's uh, just summarize it. A dose of, of some mighty fine, triple gameplays. Yeah, you got some mighty fine triple gameplays. That, that's that's rare in these times and ages. Oh, then you can upload all at once or uh, yeah. different things. All right, so let's just all uh, up all at once. Sorry, so let's just give you like a quick little recap of um what we just discussed here. We're talking about girls, we're talking about girls, drugs, um, and popularity. Drugs, popularity, why people do drugs, like girl types, dream girls, stuff like that. I think this the is way the girls work. Commentary, yeah, just a little bit like that. I felt like this commentary um was pretty well. Hope you guys really enjoy it. And the gameplay should be wrapping up in like three more kills. Let's see how fast we can get these. All right, two more now. I can't find anyone. I know, me neither. It has been this way the entire match. Oh, there's someone. And the last guy, can I get him? Nope. Yeah, you well, did. Well, that was it. You suck. All that was it. 22 and 11. Not bad. Love you all. Yeah, not bad, too. Alright All right, guys, as always, remember to like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Thank you very much. Love you guys.